Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on trading cards. So this is a really cool plugin which allows you to find different cards, have decks, and um, have different rarities in cards. So if I kill this creeper, he might drop uh, a trading card. There's some drops over here, so we're going to look at them. we got the pig and the skeleton card. So it says uh, the type, the information, the series, and whether it's common, rare, or, or legendary or whatnot. So if I um, get out of here, let me just go through here, and then go into game mode zero, we can open up our deck and look at all the cards we've got. So uh, we've got a blade, which is an uncommon card. So you can configure a lot in the um, config files, there's quite a few of them. And um, this slime just dropped one as well. It dropped a creeper card, which is also common, so we can put that in our deck. Uh, so let me go and game mode one and I can show you um, some of the commands so um, what is it 4 slash xptc which is quite confusing but um, this will show you all the commands so you can give yourself a new deck if you want to um, it's only got a certain amount of slots so you, you need more to store all the cards you have you can uh, toggle the cards on and off on your server so cards are now disabled like that you can list like this and that will show you all the common cards the uncommon the rare the very rare and the legendary so um, shulker I wonder what that is I've never heard of that before um, hmm, yeah interesting and obviously you can um, give yourself a card so let's go ahead and do that so give card uh, rarity legendary legendary and the name shulker there we go so we've given ourselves a shulker card um, so yeah that's pretty cool and obviously you can give a shiny card as well random card a booster pack or a giveaway so let's do the giveaway which is a really nice feature maybe you could set that to um, happen every day or something so giveaway rarity it's going to be legendary again let's check out some of these and we got the wither so I am recording with Shadow Place. So if I go into um, the folder, you can see there are four files. So the messages, pretty straightforward. You probably don't want to mess with this. The decks, you shouldn't touch this unless you know what you're doing, uh, as it says here. So don't touch this. That just saves data about people's decks. The config and the cards are what you can edit. So here, it shows you all of the different cards and what type they are, so legendary, here they all are. You could get rid of Shulker if you really wanted to, uh, like that, because I don't know what it is. And we can go into the config as well. Um, now, this is where you can set the different colors. Um, I would actually set legendary as gold. That makes a little more sense. And rare, probably red. I don't know, I don't really agree with these colors, to be honest. Rare, maybe a lighter red, and uncommon, yeah, they're fine. So let's scroll to the top. That's the best place to start. You can change the server name. So obviously, uh, server craft, as I usually do. You can hide the enchant. American mode. Basically, this sets the date the wrong way around if you're American and you, you want it like that for some reason. Uh, you can change the prefix of a card, change the material. So you could change it to an emerald if you really wanted to. I don't know why. Uh, deck material, book. So that makes a lot of sense and down here is a really cool thing you can s schedule cards to be dropped to people just randomly um, so that is really cool and um, you can add Townian vault support as well so um, I've never used Townian before I tried but it's very complicated I don't really like that plugin uh, booster packs here you can edit the price uh, number of special and normal cards so you can customize this uh, however much you want and obviously the chance of getting a card when you kill a mob so obviously um, the chance of getting a drop when you kill um, a hostile mob such as a skeleton or a creeper is 20% so I killed three hostile mobs and got two cards which is really lucky but when I went on a killing spree killing sheep I did not receive any so uh, yeah, that's really interesting. 
boss chance, so if you kill a wither or something, you're definitely going to get a card, uh, which is good. So, uh, yeah, that is the config. Um, it's a really interesting plugin for your server. People could go ahead and trade their cards and get the full collection. Um, so, yeah, that'd be really fun. So, you can download this plugin for free on Spigot. Yes, it is Spigot. Um, so, subscribe, like, comment. And I will see you when I get back from Insomnia I-55, uh, if some of you know what that is. So, uh, yes, I shall return.